Welcome to Faith Positive Television. I'm Dr. Joey Fawcett. Let's talk this week about God's new thing for your work. Isaiah 43, 19 in the NIV translation reads, See, I am doing a new thing. Now it springs up. Do you not perceive it? I installed a gas fireplace in our office. We lit her up and began enjoying the warmth, and after about 10 minutes, the logs cut off. So I fiddled with the knob, turning it until the logs came back on. Then they went off again. I checked the gas line, no kinks. I thought maybe the flow was low. The valve was wide open. Desperate, I called the store I purchased it from and talked with Jesse. Jesse, this gas fireplace you sold me is broken, I said. It keeps cutting off. Did you check the gas line, he asked? Yes. What about the valve? Wide open. Okay, does the knob you turn to make it come on have numbers on it? I checked it, and I said, it sure does. And then Jesse said, well, then it has a built-in thermostat. When it reaches a certain temperature, it cuts off, but it'll come back on when it cools down. Oh, I said rather sheepishly, mine at home doesn't have a thermostat. So I waited and I watched. The logs went off and then they came back on. Nothing at all like the gas logs in my home. So what about you? Do you ever find yourself doing business in the old familiar ways only to discover that something changed and you didn't know it? Like a new product or an updated software system or maybe the tax laws changed, right? You'd think that we Christian business persons are more open to change than anybody else. Our story, after all, is one of transforming change. We're new creatures in Christ, right? The truth is you aren't any more open to change than the rest of the negative world. The truth is you prefer the familiar over the new thing God wants to do at work. Preferring the familiar over God's new thing is an obstacle to increasing your faith with greater joy at work so that you love God and others more. In fact, when you go to work today, do these three things to replace the familiar with God's new thing. First, open your mind. When something new is presented, you mentally look for what you already know. Bridge what you know with the new. Find one thing you can do that's new that's somewhat familiar. Second, open your heart. Fear is a common reaction to the new. Replace, I'm afraid because I might make a mistake, with God, strengthen my faith with courage to persevere. Third, open your spirit. You know, it's really easy to feel isolated when you face something new. So replace, I'm a lone ranger with, thank you, God, for your Holy Spirit who guides me. Open yourself to God's new thing and watch as your work warms to new heights of increasing faith with greater joy and more love for God and others. For Faith Positive Television, I'm Dr. Joey Fawcett. Discover your free Faith Positive coaching program, Be Still and Know, at getpositive.today slash faith hyphen positive.